this is it. A can't miss game and a backdrop to match what is a special occasion. The fans had this one circled on their calendars long ago, and now it's a matter of who will dominate on the pitch. Top players, big characters on the big stage, a highly exciting prospect. It's West Ham United, they take on Real Madrid, and it's coming up next on EA TV. Hello, great to be with you. We're here in Stratford at the London Stadium, a ground built originally for the Olympics in 2012. I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's West Ham United, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. The concession of a corner here. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, Jude Bellingham has become one of the finest all-around midfield players in world football. That's no exaggeration. What do you expect to see from him today? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-twos around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. Needs to clear it. Real Madrid have given it away. David Alaba. Rudiger has it. Oh, that's really untidy. And fine goalkeeping. Superb effort to keep it in. Vinicius Junior. What can Real do from this position? A fine reading of the situation. Just not testing the keeper at all with that cross. Maxwell Cornet. Fine teamwork to win it back. Vinicius Junior took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Paqueta. It's a weighted pass. It's got to be. And the ball is loose. Can they? Oh, chance taken. There is opportunism for you. But a disappointed goalkeeper. Well, the action underway. Can Real find a response now? Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Vladimir Tsofal. Mohamed Kudus. Alvarez now. Attacking possibilities for West Ham. Cornet. He must finish! It's still alive! Well, they survived the attack. So far. On the ball, Mikael Antonio. Is it going to be? The save was a good one. David Alaba. Alaba. Oh, a brilliantly timed tackle when it really mattered.
Vinicius Junior. And Bellingham. Looking for the right angle. Corner for Real. Can they use it productively? Well, they fancy a short one. Looking to cut inside. And the deflection means a corner. And short it is. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. Mavropanos. And West Ham being afforded too much space here. Well, getting close to the half-time interval with Real Madrid behind. What have you made of it so far, Stuart? Well, it's been a fairly even first half so far, but they haven't shown enough creativity, particularly in midfield, where there's been too many negative passes. And a goal! The keeper couldn't stop it. Real Madrid on terms. Well, here we can see just how good this goal is. It has everything. Skill, pace and power. There was no stopping him there. And as a play it goes, throw in coming up here. So far. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. Rudiger. This is Alaba. Possession one. A good and fair challenge. Maxwell Cornet. Well, no stopping him. And that brings to an end the first half here at the London Stadium. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. That's a good ball. Modric. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And space to cross it. Terrific piece of anticipation. Vinicius Junior. And making the move to the inside. Modric. That is a tackle and a half. Emerson. Throw in for West Ham. And just like that, they've given the ball away. 
Jude Bellingham. This is Kroos. Tony Kroos, full of ideas on the passing front. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place. But give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. Eder Militao using space on the opposite flank now and Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore really good challenge the tackle completely mistimed and you would expect a booking under the circumstances And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Paqueta. And a tidy challenge. Van Verde. And on to Bellingham. Vinicius! And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. And deciding to go short with this one. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Kudus. So far. Might be able to set up the chance. Antonio! My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Here it is now. The substitution. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. Now sending it in. Really good build-up, but no end product. Paqueta. Nicely timed tackle. Into the final 20 minutes. Valverde. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Can Lucy Davis, that's Lucy Davis, please come to reception. Jude Bellingham. And now Rodrigo. Valverde. Rodrigo. And back to Valverde. Will he finish? Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Rodrigo. And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. Well, let's take another look, and it's a very good goal. And they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. Well, it's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3 1 it is. High quality defending. Carvajal. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Alaba. Here's Vinicius Junior. 
Well, that's good defending. Well organised at the back. Vinicius Junior. And a goal to settle the issue once and for all. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. He skips past his marker, and that gives him the space to get his shot away. Excellent stuff from him. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Kings. West Ham United, coming off the pitch, number 33, Emerson. Coming onto the pitch, number 11, Calvin Phillips. This is Alaba. Just the challenge that was required. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. Promising pass. Well, they have to pay attention. And it might be. And there it is. A goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at their best. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Federico Valverde. And with that, the attack fizzles out. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum. Of, could pull one back here. Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. Tony Kors. And there goes the final whistle. Now we can say it. They'll be staying in this division next season. No relegation for them, Stuart. Yeah, what relief for the players and the manager. It's been a really difficult season for them. But they're safe and that's all that matters. They'll need to be better next season, that's for sure. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer. And Stuart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was. A fitting backdrop for a match of massive significance. The stage is set, a packed house at the ready, awaiting two teams who like nothing better than to test themselves on a stage like this. The tricky part is trying to decide which side will outfox the other. All the action coming up on EA TV. Hello everyone, well here's something we say every day of the week, don't we? It's a beautiful day for football in Manchester at the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner as always is Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It is Manchester City taking on Real Madrid. Thanks Derek as always, this should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium, we've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And just losing control of the ball, and it will be a throw-in. Well, not taking any chances and tipping that over the bar. And taken short. Course. And whipped into the box. Ah, goalkeeper's ball. Not the best of crosses, really, was it? Out of play, Real Madrid throw here. Vinicius Junior. That's a go! 
Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Course with the corner. It might still be problematic. Federico Valverde. Well read to ease the pressure. Incision with the pass from Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, keeper dealt with it. It's a short corner. Bernardo Silva. No way through. De Bruyne. And playing it back. And they might forge ahead. And still danger here. And a goal. Well, it looks easy when you can put them away like that. 1-0 then. David Alaba. This is Kroos. Rudiger. Tony Kroos. Oh, getting the ball forward. Can he get them level? Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Silva. Holland. De Bruyne now. De Bruyne. Chances on. Oh, so near. Off the post. Well, Real are still only one down, but I'm not sure how. That was so close. They need a reaction here. Well, before they think about that, they've got to concentrate on keeping the door firmly bolted. Sloppy, Carvajal. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. He's going forward well here. Bellingham! And denied by the post. And putting paid to the danger. Corner kick then to Real. What can they do from this situation? It should be. And it's in. Beyond the goalkeeper. Real Madrid on level. So underway again. Following the goal that made things level. He has teammates around him. Trying his luck. Well, he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Said he could be onto something. Just the challenge that was required. And Bellingham. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, here's the replay. And just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Vinicius Junior out of play in a Real Madrid throw in coming up Rudiger this is Kroos 
Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Clean challenge. De Bruyne. This could square the game. And you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. Well, they know they need to stop him. But nothing comes of it. Can he finish? And the keeper taking it cleanly. Walker. Phil Foden now. Manuel Akanji. Erling Haaland. Good tackle, take it away. David Alaba. Will he play it in? And a very good challenge. Could be dangerous. And De Bruyne is in here. And that is going to be all for the first 45 then here at... The ball moving again. Real have the lead, but they won't be taking anything for granted. Nicely timed tackle. Modric. Alaba. Vinicius Jr. Looking for the angle. Timely intervention. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Valverde. It's got to be! And pure instinct. From the keeper. Well, a top class reaction from a top class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. They favoured a short one here. Firing it towards goal. Just can't get it past him. Erling Haaland. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Oh, that's a really good run. City down by a goal and in need of inspiration from the corner. Well, it's been a while, but these fans are now coming to life. Can they equalise here? Grealish. Tremendously strong in the tackle. De Bruyne cuts it back. Well, what a stop it was. Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. Well, capable of so much better, to be honest. Well, I expected more as well, Derek. I thought from that sort of position, he had every chance of scoring, but it's a poor effort. Eder Militao. Now, Eder Militao. The ball with Luka Modric. Federico Valverde. Well, it did look promising, but no threat in the end. Vinicius Jr. Carvajal. And drawing it back. 
And the penalty has been given here. And it has been judged to have been a bookable offence. Well, I think the referee's got that right all round. It was a penalty and it was a yellow card. And there it is, perfectly executed. Let's take another look. He deceives the goalkeeper really well here by getting to dive one way before placing it into the opposite side. A really good penalty. So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. Rodrigo. Oh, good vision. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Valverde. Here's Carvajal. Really inventive stuff from Real here. Superbly read and executed. This is a message for Alex O'Neill. Alex O'Neill, can you please return to This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Grealish. So a throw in for Real Madrid. Rudiger. And now Rodrigo. Tony Kroos. Federico Valverde. And now Rodrigo. Released it nicely. Vinicius Jr. Vinicius! And the keeper showing tremendous command. Short corner favoured. Can he convert? Oh, he saved it well. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Corner given to Real Madrid. And played short. And lining it up. And a good take under duress there. Alvarez. De Bruyne. Well read to ease the pressure. And just five minutes remaining. Firing it in. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. So on the cusp of the final whistle, and the visitors very much in command, Stuart. Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. Vasquez. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Through ball from De Bruyne. The final whistle. It is another victory for them. And dare I say it, Stuart, they rock.
Now it's for real. The tactics and squad strengths have all been analysed by committed fans and neutral observers. A confrontation that all football lovers will revel in, knowing that we might be about to witness a simply unmissable occasion. Comprehensive coverage coming up live on EA TV. It's very much a temple of football, the Santiago Bernabeu, right here on the Spanish capital, Madrid. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And if the chips fall the way the fans hope they will, we could be talking about a promotion story today. Can he finish this? Oh, yes, a goal! And a historic moment to boot! Well, that's a big moment for them. They've just got to keep their focus now. And Liverpool restart the game. A wake-up call for them, perhaps. Cabajal. It's still there for him. It's a corner. Favouring the short one. Late towards the near post. Well, it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it left the boot. The high press was on, and the chance is on. Well, possibilities inside the box. It's got to be! And that is defending of the highest order. David Alaba. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Couldn't quite hang on. Oh, what on earth has happened? He's missed it, and what a glorious chance it was. Well, it's a bad miss. He really should score there. Alexander Arnold. Mo Salah. Good distribution. Very quick thinking there. Well, no stopping him. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Bajal. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Luis Diaz. Darwin Nunez. A very good tackle. Luis Diaz, encouraging move from Liverpool. Really good build-up, but no end product. Rodrigo, crucial interception amid impending danger. Under real pressure here. Tiago and Tiago lost custody of it. Tony Cross. A oh, nice ball over the top. A glorious chance. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Keen to take it short here. Might be dangerous. And a Real corner. Hungry for more. 
They favoured a short one here. Textbook defending inside the box. Over the touchline for what will be a Real Madrid throw. Being pressed and pressed high. Might be able to set up the chance. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Oh, to level the match. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. And showing fine vision. Tony Kroos. And now Rodrigo. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. Rodrigo. It's looking promising. Carvajal. Now, who can he pick out? And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Not a short corner here. Rodrigo. Keeper did his job to begin with. Danger averted for now. Real Madrid regaining possession. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Thiago. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, back underway, and Liverpool hoping to find an effective route back into this match. And it's a quality pass. This could be the equaliser, but oh, what an important save! How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. And Liverpool have the ball again. And a chance to level it. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Well, Liverpool down by a goal and in need of a bit of magic from the corner. Let's see about the delivery. Struggling to get it away. And the ball is loose. Thiago. Ibrahima Konate. The referee has let the advantage accrue to Liverpool. Well, they're behind, but they might be onto something here. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Well, it's open up. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. This is Thiago. That's useful play. Can he do it? And the goal was staring him in the face. But he couldn't take advantage of the chance. Well, that would have extended their lead. What a golden opportunity that was. Alexander-Arnold. Trent Alexander-Arnold. Now with Konate. Being pressed here. Ibrahima Konate. And on to Alexander-Arnold. Committed challenge.
David Alaba. Tony Kroos. This is Alaba. Jude Bellingham is with Vinicius Junior. It's a weighted pass. And still looking for space. Cutting it back. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Must score! Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Short corner it is. And a very good challenge. Konate. Van Dijk with it. Alexis McAllister. Robertson. Mo Salah. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Twenty minutes to go. Alexis McAllister. Diaz. Textbook defending inside the box. Eder Militao. And Carvajal untidy in possession there. Oh, to level the match. Well, the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. Well, he needs to be careful here. Pressing like that will help the cause. Breaking at pace. Well, they have to pay attention. Well, the supporters think it's on. No way through! A disadvantage Liverpool here. Could be dangerous. This could level it. But denied by the keeper. And at this late stage of the proceedings, it could... be highly significant well it could be a huge moment Derek so little time left now who can he pick out well, no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper And in the end, he's run out of space. Really clever pressing. Options in the centre. This could finish it. Oh, they've done it! And surely now, promotion in their future. Well, that should clinch it. What a big goal that is. Just look at this again. He's so hard to knock off the ball once he gets going. Of course the defending could be better, but that's a great individual goal. Jota. What a commitment to defending. Now the counter-attack looks on. 
Well, a disappointing end to that break. So Bosloy and slipped through beautifully. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. He's driven in the corner. And defensive play to be applauded. Dicing with a bit of danger here. And full time here. Now we can say it is official. Promotion secured. Well, the target at the outset was promotion, and they've achieved it and fully deserve it. They've been brilliant. Well, now they have a chance to... Cameras are fixed to one man. Well, Derek, his outstanding attribute is his pace. Not just over the first few yards, but over longer distances as well. And that makes him so difficult to play against. Defenders are unsure whether to get tight or drop off. A dynamic player. It's Liverpool. They take on Real Madrid. And it's coming up next on EA TV. Well, the stage is truly set for what should be a terrific night of football here at Anfield. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And here's a question before we start. Will this be the day when the title issue is settled? It is Liverpool, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, what a great season they've had. Brilliant in attack, solid defensively, and a joy to watch. And a goal! Vinicius Junior and danger averted well read it is to be a throw in Valverde and he favours the inside routes Rodrigo and couldn't quite square the game close well it's certainly a decent effort but not quite good enough they still trail here high pressing and good high pressing Valverde here's Carvajal can he play it in attending to his defensive chores Militao. So a Real Madrid corner. Well, they fancy a short one. A good and fair challenge. Luis Diaz. And return to Diaz. And the corner for Liverpool. And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. And a corner like that, every goalkeeper's dream, really. Federico Valverde. And they have possession again. Salah. That is how to keep it out of the net. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. Oh, it's an unbelievable save by Courtois. And over it comes. Well, not away properly. 
Well, the fans want to see a shot. Teammate available. Spot on with that tackle. Chance maybe to use their counter-attacking ability to good effect. Can they use it to their advantage? Is it going to be? Oh, a smart stop. Keen to take it short here. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. And a throw-in forthcoming. Could cross it in here. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. Well read to ease the pressure. Andrew Robertson. Darwin Nunez. Might be a chance to break. Really annoying for them. Couldn't take advantage. David Alaba. Tony Kroos. On the ball, Rudiger. Attacking possibilities for Real. Can he get the level? There it is! And they're right back in this now. Well, they certainly needed that. Can they now go and win it? Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Salah. Well, there's the pullback. And still a chance. Under real pressure here. Can they open things up? What a commitment to defending. And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. Vinicius Jr. Modric with options around him. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. That's a short corner. Nicely timed tackle. Potentially productive here for Liverpool on the flank. Has someone to play it to. Real defensive resilience. Now well, nothing comes of it. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. Jude Bellingham. Valverde. And Bellingham, opportunity to level it, couldn't grab hold of it, and it's in, beyond the goalkeeper, Real Madrid on level. Well, let's look at this again, he's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here, but when he shoots, I expected him to go across the goalkeeper, he should never beat the goalkeeper inside that near post, that's not good keeping. Rodrigo, in with a chance. A oh, strong hand on the ball. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. High pressing and good high pressing. Can he take the chance? Keeper getting the touch. And the move breaks down. And that brings to an end. And the battle has recommenced here at Anfield.
Real find themselves in a position of menace. Happy to take on the shot. Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Wide in the end. Well, the stats back up what we've seen so far. Some good attacking football, chances for both teams, and plenty to enjoy. Let's hope for more of the same. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Salah. Really good build-up, but no end product. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. And a chance to whip it in here. Timely intervention. Jones. What can he do with it now? Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. Darwin Nunez. Electing to shoot. Foiling his opponent completely. Diaz. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Modric. Valverde. And on to Bellingham. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Alaba. Did well to clear it away. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? And Bellingham. And a very good challenge. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, they couldn't quite use that break in the manner that they'd hoped. Well, a decent position for Liverpool to be in. Well, the supporters think it's on. Well, it's great when you can rely on your keeper. Eder Militao. The ball with Luka Modric. Federico Valverde. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. And a yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. Tony Kroos into the final 20 minutes well there's the pullback a smart stop here well they've decided to make a change taken short Superbly read and executed. It's a message from Jay Cheatham. Happy birthday, Endo. Jay. From all of your friends, including Mike, Trevor and Brian. Federico Valverde. It is a decent-looking attack here. Is it going to be... Well, plenty of power there, but in fairness, should have made the keeper work. Grafenberg. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. Feeling down here is that he twisted his knee when turning. The test must score! Spectacular save, top-class goalkeeping. Courtois must clatter it clear.
And eventually, goalkeeper's ball. Well, you can sense the relief amongst his teammates, but what a first save that was. Well worth bearing in mind, one point isn't good enough. They need three for the title, Stuart. Well, you can sense the frustration out there. They just haven't quite done enough today, but that could change very quickly. Still time left. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. Intercepting it intelligently. Five minutes remaining and level pegging here. And level it is in the closing moments. Can Real Madrid change that? Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Grafenberg. And forcing the mistake. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. Excellent vision. Tremendously strong in the tackle. And we will have just one additional minute. And there goes the final whistle. A draw not what they were looking for. They have designs on the title. The drama will go on, Stuart. Will you... This could be a very special day. A draw is all they need to be crowned champions. It's Barcelona. They take on Real Madrid, and it's coming up next on EA TV. Hello from the Catalan capital and one of the world's great cities, Barcelona. My name is Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. And what a last day scenario we have. Will they clinch the title here and now? It's Barcelona and they take on Real Madrid. Well, what a game we have in store for us today, Derek. Final day of the season, the title still to be decided. What more could you ask for? They've done all the hard work over the past nine games. Question is, can they finish the job now? A point will see them lift the trophy. Hopefully it lives up to the billing. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Mark and Reiter Stegen starts in goal. Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Carvajal starts with David Alaba as fullbacks. Federico Valverde plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Whatever way you slice it, Robert Lewandowski is a goal-scoring force of nature. What sort of performance do you expect to see from him, Stuart? Well, Derek, we know he's a good all-round finisher, but I think his greatest attribute is his head inability. He seems to hang in the air, he's got great technique when the ball comes onto his head, and he usually hits the target. That's his greatest skill. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Gundogan. Here's Rafinha. Advantage, Barcelona. Really good build-up, but no end product.
Lewandowski. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. The verdict is offside here. Lewandowski. And Real come away with it. Modric. Now with Bellingham. De Jong. And Kroos failed to hold it. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. Valverde. And on to Bellingham. Well, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. Kunde. Gundogan and a tidy challenge able to skip past his man had to get that spot on and did fantastic challenge decisive in the tackle and a throw in here Alaba and on to Bellingham can he find the angle and there it breaks down but credit to the defence timely intervention promising looking ball might still be able to do a bit of damage well, able to survive that attacking push. Oh, big chance! Great movement. Oh, that is an outrageously good stop. Well, great reflex from the keeper. He did brilliantly there. That's a very fine piece of tackling. Gives it a go. A gift for any goalkeeper. Well, those stats aren't great reading, are they? Neither side is playing with any fluency so far, and as a result, we've seen a pretty dull game. It has to get better. The cross is on. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Gundogan. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. Perhaps an opportunity here for Real Madrid to take the lead. Corner. Well, had no intention of losing out. Takes aim. He can't hold on to it. Well, a time for cool heads. Lewandowski. On to De Jong. Joao Felix. And a fine tackle. Running with the ball confidently. And options in the centre. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And defensive play to be applauded. The first half here comes to an end.
Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Very quick thinking there. Bellingham. Oh, good looking run. That is a tackle and a half. Plenty of support here. Gives it a go. Able to close down the shot. That's how to dispossess your opponent. Carvajal. Luka Modric. Oh, it might be. Oh, narrowly wide. So unlucky. Pedri. Lewandowski. An effective challenge. Progress has been made by Luka Modric. Rodrigo. Now with course. Carvajal. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Error from the keeper. Will they seize on it? Well, a case of Jekyll and Hyde, but no damage done. Well, I'd say he's very, very lucky because that was a poor mistake to start with, but in the end, a very good recovery. Pressure applied. Can they make something of it? Vinicius Jr. to take the lead. Modric. Can he put it in? A smart stop here. Well, Real have had so much of the ball in the last 15 minutes and they're playing really well and creating chances. It's surely only a matter of time before they take the lead here. Yes, it might be on for them once more. Alaba. Well, it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper. Given away by Barcelona. Real Madrid get the throw in. David Alaba. Now Eder Militao. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. Can they forge ahead? Still possibilities. Foiling his opponent completely. <laughs> Twenty minutes to go. So a throw in here. Valverde. And the flag does go up offside. Joao Felix. This is looking threatening. And passing it through. Well, going for power from there but not worrying the goalkeeper in the slightest. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own.
what can Real do from this position? Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Pedri. And a strong tackle. Still level. Real Madrid continue to look for what could be a winner. Brahim. Pretty simple for the keeper. Well, the fact of the matter, Stuart, is they have the power. They can win the title from this position. Well, what they can't do is invite pressure by keep passing backwards here. They need to turn their opponents round and go longer. Making progress. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. take the lead here with time running out a corner to Real Madrid and with play stop they will make the change now and a short corner here Aurelien Chouameni and Bellingham and the flag has been raised here well, there can't have been a lot in that. Torres. Here's Rafinha. Barcelona on the attack in the closing moments. Still level here. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. And the final whistle confirms what the fans wanted to hear. They are the champions. Cameras trained on one man. Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, have a little one-two, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. It truly is a special place, a stadium every football fan should visit should he or she get the chance. The Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And understandable that there's a bit of extra excitement in the air. After all, it is the first match of the new campaign. It's Real Madrid, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, they were excellent last season, but can they do the same against better opponents? Well, today will be a good test for them, but I think they'll do OK over the season. And the starting players for Real Madrid... Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Short corner favoured. Well, there's an example of how to press high up. Oh, what an opportunity. Superb chance. Well, the goal was gaping at him, but he couldn't take the opportunity. Well, I think he just snatched at that. He'll know that was a poor miss in the end. Eder Militao. Well, Federico Valverde has that electric quality about him and Stuart, I wonder what you think he might contribute in this game. 
well, Derek. We know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-twos around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. Tony Kors. Well, good run and good ball control, but timely defending when it mattered. Vinicius. Eder Militao. This is Alaba. Modric. Vinicius Jr. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Vinicius Junior and still looking for space read it well Rodrigo Tony Kroos. Eder Militao. And Real with the ball again. Now what can they do from here? Well, disappointing end to the move. Able to skip past his man. Rodrigo. Spot on with that tackle. Modric. How about the cross? Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Rudiger. Real Madrid doing well to regain possession here. He's in here. He went for placement, but not to be. Well, that's a big miss. 1v1 against the keeper, and he's missed the target. Eder Militao. Modric. Rudiger. Here's Carvajal. Rodrigo. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. This looks promising. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. And decent acreage for Real Madrid to run into. Crossing possibilities. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? They favoured a short one here. Pulls it back. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Really good build-up, but no end product. There will be one minute added on at the end. 
David Alaba. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. You might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Stuart. Well, he didn't contribute enough in that first half. I think he needs to work harder to get on the ball. He was far too static. In my view, he's got to make more runs behind this back line in the second half. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Some of the fans are screaming, have a go. Tremendous reflexes, Thibaut Courtois. Taken short and using his strength to shield the ball. Magnificent challenge to win it back. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. Fine cross into the middle. Oh, good work by the keeper. Course. On to Valverde. Modric, spot on. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Great opportunity. Well, I must say, I thought they were about to illuminate the scoreboard with the number one first goal of the contest, but not so. Well, how are they not leading here? What a chance to open the score, and as you mentioned, Derek. Went in strongly, decisively. Well, Real Madrid have certainly had all the possession over the last 15 minutes, and they're playing really well and creating chances. It's surely only a matter of time before they take the lead here. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. And it's played into the centre. And that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. Can someone get on the end of this? And the goalkeeper really exuding confidence. Eder Militao. Well, using the space really well, but now can they push on? Well, the fans want to see a shot and keeping it out. And taken short. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Vinicius Jr. It's still alive! Well, that's how to beat your opponent. And not cleared away properly! Well, what a good save that was. Real really should be in front now. That could prove to be a big moment in the game.
Yes, they just have to make sure they stay defensively compact here. Bellingham and a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it and now they've been rewarded. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. And there to intervene. Valverde. Now with Bellingham. Will he play it in? Oh, must be. Looked as though there might be a threat, but not so in the end. Good defending. Vinicius Junior. And back to Bellingham. Oh, a tremendous block. Federico Valverde. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Federico Valverde. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. And whipped into the box. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. And Real Madrid have the ball again. High pressing at its best. Rodrigo. Real in a good position out wide. Now he must favour the cross. Brilliantly blocked. It was always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Still level. Real Madrid continue to look for what could be a winner. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, Real have to score soon. Time is running out. But these fans can sense the winner's coming. An alert piece of defending. Well, a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Oh, a brilliantly timed tackle when it really mattered. Valverde. And successfully cut out. Federico Valverde. Brahim. He's in here. Well, it might still work out for them. Well, no way through in the end. And Bellingham. Well, this could really help the cause. Can he put them in front? He does. And with so little time left, that might be the winner. Wonderful drama. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. we are going to have two additional minutes oh he really bruised the crossbar what a vital intervention good pressure to regain possession has a go and just narrowly wide in the end and that will be all for this game anyway A special atmosphere and a grand occasion. One the players and fans alike have been anticipating in the tension-laden days leading up to this fixture. But now the talking has to stop and the football must take over. Who's going to emerge victorious? It's a hard question to answer.
Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. Hello and welcome to one of the most recognisable venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray in position to bring you live match commentary and my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And with kickoff just moments away, we really should be in for a magnificent occasion. It's Real Madrid facing Manchester City. Well, it's so important to make a good start to the season. If they lose again here, it immediately puts the players and coach under the spotlight. They must get something from this game. Well read to ease the pressure. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. David Alaba plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Luka Modric plays alongside Federico Valverde in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. The cutback. Alaba with the block. There it is. The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. Rodrigo Timely intervention Well the fans are going mad here They think that was a penalty Carvajal Now with Valverde They could level it Great. It's got to be well in some Style, Ederson prevents a goal. Look at Modric. That's a nice looking ball. They just couldn't stay in front. And now this match is all square. Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Vardiol. Phil Foden now. De Bruyne. On to Holland. A good and fair challenge. Speculative effort here. Eder Militao. And considerable space afforded Real Madrid. And crossed in there. The clearance wasn't decisive. David Alaba. Rudiger. Vinicius Jr. On to Carvajal. Well, the supporters think it's on. And what a magical save it was! And taken short. Modric, a deep delivery. And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, here's the replay, and they work it well just to change the angle on the cross, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Bernardo Silva. And 
delivered by Bernardo Silva here. And the cross is immediately dealt with. Well, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? And a very good challenge. Holland. Real Madrid have given us away. Foden. And swiftly ending that attack. And playing it through. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the position they were in. Carvajal. David Alaba. Eder Militao. Real using width to good effect. Teammates in the middle. And the danger still on. For the last line of defence. Phil Foden. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. This could be the equaliser. And it's gone in. Just what was needed for Manchester City. Who now have squared it. And he could really get at the opposition. Oh, totally committed. Danger not finished, though. He's got to score. Wonderful block. And Bellingham. And still an opportunity. Well, they can keep possession of it now. And he's won the ball. Well, he's certainly not alone. Valverde. Well, the fans want to see a shot. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. Holland. City know that wide area is really opening up. Rodri. Now with Grealish. Holland. Foden. Opportunity, couldn't quite hang on. And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital. Well, he didn't let his team down in the first half, did he? Into the second half then, and these two sides are locked together. Just can't really choose between them at the moment. They're really pressing their opponents. Really good high press. Chances on. Oh, it was a crucial challenge. Aurelien Chouameni. Now Eder Militao. Well, nothing to split the two sides, but this move looks promising. Vinicius! Oh, great block. It's a perfect challenge. De Bruyne. De Bruyne threading it through. City pushing forward with options available. Real losing possession. Holland. He could pick out a teammate. Foden. Holland. Now with De Bruyne. And saved by the keeper. Well, as you can see, this has been a fairly open contest. Chances at both ends, plenty of good attack in play, and it's been really entertaining.
Vinicius Junior. Options in the middle. Chance here. He's blocked it. Vadiol. High pressing and good high pressing. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. Valverde. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. From down here, it looks as though he landed actually on top of his elbow. That's why he's in so much discomfort, and that's why, of course, the bench are so concerned. Cheers, Jeff. Rodrigo. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Could cross it in here. Well, that's good defending. Well organised at the back. Foden. Seemed to switch off for a moment. And now a throw in. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Grealish. Holland. Can they forge ahead? No. Chance missed. And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Shuameni. Attacking possibilities for Real. But they took care of the situation defensively. Walker. Just 15 minutes remaining. Oh, that's... Can he put them ahead? Oh, crucial tackle. Brilliant. Rodrigo. Well, a really good run, but nothing comes of it. Foden. Can he find the right pass? If Real Madrid could come up with a winner at this stage, it could be decisive. Really good challenge. Now can they counter clinically? Well, they have to pay attention. And the counter-attack came to nothing. Must take the lead here. Making sure nothing untoward. And swept off the line. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Oh, great defending. Ronaldo Silva. This looks more than decent. Sends it back. Textbook. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. Well, no card, just a warning and a fair few protestations. Well, not every fair. Goal! Taking aim from the spot and finding the target. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. They knew they wanted to apply the pressure, and they did. In a dangerous position. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. They're going for the short one. And the referee brings this match to a close. Not the result Real Madrid were looking for. I wonder what you made of this. Yes.
Can't ask for any more. How could it be otherwise when two high-level sides go head-to-head -head and toe-to-toe? -to -toe? This is football out of the very top draw. Stay with us on EA TV for the live action as it happens. from one of the great venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's Real Madrid taking on Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek. But... Will he find the net? A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game, just what they were hoping to produce. Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Vinicius Junior. What can he do with it now? This could be the equaliser. What a vital intervention. That's effective pressure, high up the pitch. Rodrigo, can he put it in? And a goal! An end-to-end -end game, and they weren't behind for long. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. Rodrigo. And Valverde. Vinicius. He's in with a chance. Decent enough idea. Shame about the execution. Well, I don't think that was good enough. And I also think it was the wrong option. Valverde. Rodrigo. Real Madrid regaining possession. It is to be a throw-in. And Bellingham. And he takes it on. Oh, keeper dealt with it. And short it is. Look at Modric. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Another short corner here. Can they forge ahead? And able to get a body in the way. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Valverde. Oh, crucial tackle. Brilliant. Tony Kroos.
a special atmosphere and a grand occasion. One the players and fans alike have been anticipating in the tension-laden days leading up to this fixture. But now the talking has to stop and the football must take over. Who's going to emerge victorious? It's a hard question to answer. Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you from Manchester here on EA TV Live. Hello to you on a cracking night here at the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And with kickoff just moments away, we really should be in for a magnificent occasion. It is Manchester United, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, I just hope they can show signs of improvement today, because up to... And in with a real chance! Oh, that was a chance to give them an early advantage. Well, they should be off to a flyer here, and that was a poor effort. He must hit the target. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. Casemiro plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield, and the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Well, it might still work out for them. He's trying to create something. Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, nothing untoward happened. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Vinicius Jr. starts with Rodrigo out wide. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Lisandro Martinez and in the right position to read it and Bellingham and defensive play to be applauded Casemiro Harry Maguire now Rafael Varane And Bellingham, oh, managing to beat him. A smart stop here. Scott McTominay, clean challenge. And out of play, the pass nearly worked out, but not quite. Rafael Varane. And Real come away with it. Can they produce something? And that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. Struggling to get it away. But it just petered out. Bruno Fernandes has it. What to like about that pass? Read it superbly to take back possession. McTominay. Beautiful pass. And the flag does go up offside. Bruno Fernandes has it. Given away by Manchester United. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes has it. Regained possession. Scott McTominay. Wasteful from United. Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes has it. 
Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Look at Modric. Trying to open up the defence. Just needs to steady himself. Can they stop it going in? Well, he took care of it defensively. Casemiro. And beating the defender. But fair play, that goes down as a very good recovery. Rodrigo. Well timed tackle. danger here as he runs at them can he do it from miles out Anthony Martial United might be able to cash in oh that's a really good pass well good technique in terms of how he struck it well the referee took note of the earlier infringement and a booking it is now. Eder Militao. And now Rodrigo. And making headway. One of the final analysis, it was good defending. best challenge well this could be a chance for Real Madrid to jump ahead from a corner and in by Luka Modric and that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams Second half here at Old Trafford has commenced. Bruno Fernandes has it. Difficult player to stop, Casemiro. Has a go. Oh, did so well to deny him. Advantage, Manchester United. I must say, this looks promising. Marcia! Well, good clean catch by the keeper. Well, those stats tell you what a good game this has been. We've seen a lot of good attacking play, plenty of goal mouth action, and all done at a high tempo. It's been very entertaining so far. Plenty of support here. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Manchester United keep the ball. Advantage. Bruno Fernandes. And United have the corner. And played short. Fernandes. 
Well, they stopped them in their tracks. And Bellingham. Chance to put them in front. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Lisandro Martinez. Bruno Fernandes has it. Anthony. McTominay. Off the post and back in play. Danger averted for now. Well, United were so close to taking the lead there, but if they keep making chances, it's surely only a matter of time before they do. Yes, a really open flow to the game. End-to-end -end stuff. And Bellingham. Is this the moment? And it was a great chance for 1-0. Well, that should have been the opener, shouldn't it? What a chance that was. Here's a change for Manchester United. This is a message for Bruno Fernandes has it. At full time, can you please remain where you are and your coach will meet you outside of the stand. Thank you. Nice weight on the pass. And the keeper there to deal with it. He's having quite the game for himself. Save after save after save. Making progress. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. It's going to be United's free kick. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. That was going in. Crucial interception amid impending danger. Into the advanced position goes Modric. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Could be dangerous. Chance here. And a goal! Just when we wondered if this might finish nil-nil. There it is. They're in front. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Vinicius Jr. Great defending. Will he find the net? And a goal! An end-to-end -end game! And they weren't behind for long. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Marcus Rashford. Real did well to regain control of the ball. Tony Kroos and Valverde. Wonderfully weighted pass. And that brings the attack to an end. 
Five minutes of the 90 still to go, and the teams cannot be separated. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Here's a change for Manchester United. And he read it well. He's in with a chance. It's got to be. Oh, a crucial save at such an important stage of the game. Well, he really is a good goalkeeper in those situations. He's just kept his team in it here. Can they forge ahead? High pressing and good high pressing. How can he take them on and beat them? Oh, how about that for a tackle? And there it is, the full-time whistle. Well, they can't be separated. And goals very much part of the equation. Stuart, as always, interested to get your final analysis. Well, Derek, it was a really good game between two evenly matched teams. Both had their moments, but neither side really deserved to lose this one. Well, there's a good reason why we're highlighting him. Really dominant in attack in this game, Stuart. When they were struggling, he was the one to step up, and it's a key goal, that. A stadium alive with atmosphere and two teams ready to commit themselves to excellence for 90 captivating minutes. We're privileged to be here on an occasion that resonates with football fans everywhere. And if you think you know who's going to win, you are courageous indeed. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. It really is a sparkling day for football at one of the great venues in the world game, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. My name's Derek Ray, and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's Real Madrid, and they take on Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quick. pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. Nacho Fernandez. Given away by Real Madrid. Federico Valverde. Rudiger has it. And he has options available. Just a whisker wide of the post. Not a bad effort at all. Eder Militao. This is Kroos. Jude Bellingham. Real Madrid regaining possession. Valverde. Carvajal. Modric. Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. Vinicius Junior. Vinicius Junior. The high press was on and the chance is on. And space to cross it. To jump in front. 
Oh, great block. And good work from Real Madrid to win the ball back. Modric. Modric unable to hang on to the ball. Take it away, he won the ball. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Jude Bellingham. And Bellingham. Some of the fans are screaming, have a go. Well, you could sense the fans really wanted him to shoot and he didn't need a second invitation. Well, it was the right option, but he should be hitting the target there. That was a decent opening for him. The referee has given the advantage to Real Madrid. Can they get themselves in front here? Oh, not to be! Stopping a certain goal. Now counter-attacking possibilities. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Well, they have to pay attention. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. This is it, a can't-miss game and a backdrop to match what is a special occasion. The fans had this one circled on their calendars long ago, and now it's a matter of who will dominate on the pitch. Top players, big characters on the big stage, a highly exciting prospect. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu. And the floodlights are shining down on the players here in the Spanish capital of Madrid. We're at the Bernabeu. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner, Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's Real Madrid taking on Chelsea. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. David Alaba plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Rodrigo plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And the ball is loose. And quick thinking defensively. Being pressed hard. Well, Vinicius Junior is the sort of player who wears his heart on his sleeve. We can tell that he enjoys playing this great game. What do you expect to see from him? Well, Derek, his outstanding attribute is his pace. Not just over the first few yards, but over longer distances as well. And that makes him so difficult to play against. Defenders are unsure whether to get tight or drop off. A dynamic player. 
Carvajal. And a tidy challenge. And teammates around him. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And played through by Sterling. Modric. Well, that one has promise. And Bellingham. He's blocked it. He's gone and found the net. Brilliant piece of finishing. Magnificent goal. Well, here it is again, and you have to say, this is a very good volley. His technique is absolutely perfect. Rather than a free kick, it's advantage Chelsea. Very quick thinking there. Rudiger. Bellingham. Real Madrid sloppy in possession. Real chance. Oh, that is a superb save. Real Madrid coming away with it. The cross is on. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Mikhailo Mudrik Fernandez. Patience and persistence on the passing front in the name of finding an equaliser. Determined defending. Carvajal. And Carvajal untidy in possession there. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Enzo Fernandez. Nkunku has it. Firing it towards goal. And fine goalkeeping. A delicious piece of skill. Chelsea have it back now. Good through ball. Sterling. Has someone to play it to. Really sound defending. Can they stop it going in? And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. Bellingham and Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore well there was impending danger but good defending Rodrigo Valverde and defensive play to be applauded And Chelsea could be onto something. And he's through here. Oh, he's blocked it. Corner given to Chelsea. Now, what can they do with it? Not all that convincing defensively. Oh, chance perhaps. Blocked it brilliantly. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Eder Militao on the ball Rudiger and that is that half time here in the Spanish capital
Second half underway with Real looking to build upon a positive first half showing. Could play it in and just blotting out the danger. Simple catch, really. Thiago Silva. Nkunku has it. The ball back with Real now. Reese James. Nkunku. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Vinicius Junior. Real using width to good effect. He has time to play it over. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Clear to see who got the last touch. So a throw in it'll be. Real Madrid doing well to regain possession here. Modric good run very much in control of the situation Alaba took a really smart piece of defending to stop them is this the moment Look like a certain goal, but that's a great challenge. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Fernandez. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea, but really sticking to the task defensively. David Alaba now with Bellingham Valverde good looking sequence this Carvajal well, the timing was perfect ball one well, let's see if something comes of this a routine save Valverde Valverde and he's in well couldn't put it away they still lead however well he really should be working the goalkeeper there it's a great chance to score now they're going to alter things here's the substitution 20 minutes to go in this one that's a lovely ball really committed himself to the tackle and a throw in now Kukureya out of play for what will be a Chelsea throw. And a chance to whip it in here. And Kunku, can he finish this? Oh, fine stop. Substitution for Real Madrid. Can someone get on the end of this? Rudiger Aurelien Chouameni and Chelsea get the decision from the referee
Fernandes. James. A oh, good vision there. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. And pull back. Oh, they've done it! A goal for Chelsea, who've got themselves on level terms. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick somebody out with that cutback. And Sterling finds that bit of space to finish so clinically. That's an excellent goal. And level as is, in the closing moments, can Real Madrid change that? Well, disappointing end to the move. Mikhailo Mudrik. Sterling has it. Real in a good position out wide. They keep plugging away. And a goal! At this stage of the game, it might be decisive. And just look at their supporters. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? The onus is on Chelsea to be positive with time running out. And Sterling has it. This could level it. Oh, he couldn't finish at such an important juncture of the game as well. Well, that's a big opportunity missed. And you have to question whether they'll get another. Time very much ebbing away now. Well, it's not quite in the books yet, but almost for Real Madrid as they try to see it out. Stuart, what have you made of their overall performance? Well, they should have had this wrapped up long ago. Some of their football has been excellent, but they're going to... Must score! In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself! No stopping him, apparently! As you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. But when he shoots, I expected him to go across the goalkeeper. He should never beat the goalkeeper inside that near post. That's not good keeping. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. He's trying to create something. That is a tackle and a half. And the referee says that will do it, it's the end of the game, and it's a victory for Real Madrid. Their fans are going to be happy with this. Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there's some really nice incisive play too. It's... And welcome to one of the most recognizable venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's Real Madrid facing Manchester City. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. David Alaba plays. Surely brilliantly blocked. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Phil Foden. Holland. On to Walker. Well, the cross didn't get past the first defender. Courtois. Aurelien Chouameni. Eder Militao. Alaba not given a moment's peace.
room to roam for the Merengues here. But nothing comes of it. Foden. Really incisive defending. Well, goalkeeper mistake. Will there be a price to pay? Well, the keeper atones for the original error. Thank goodness the fans will be thinking to themselves. Well, he's got away with that one there. That was a moment of madness from the goalkeeper. And quick thinking defensively. Will it be? And it's in! 1-0. They've breached the defence. So Real restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they find an equaliser? And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Rudiger. Chouameni. This is Alaba. Rudiger has it. Sloppy there, Bernardo Silva. Rodrigo. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. De Bruyne with options. Now the cutback. Oh, a smart stop. Put in by De Bruyne. And now the goal the City fans wanted to see. It's hard to see them throwing this away. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Federico Valverde. Chouameni. Beautifully weighted ball. Really good build-up, but no end product. City pushing forward with options available. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Rodrigo. And playing it through. Rodrigo. Chance to make a game of it here. There it is! A goal to reduce the arrears and give them hope that they can turn this round. Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. On they go again, and I wonder, can Real push for a leveller here? <laughs> Determined defending. Well, not long to go now till we hear the half-time whistle and Real Madrid still trailing. Stuarts, what have you made of their first half? Well, they're certainly not out of this. They've created some good chances and look threatening, but they need to be better defensively in the second half. Just... Oh, Stuarts, a chance! Well, he didn't miss by an awful lot. Modric. Decent-looking pass. Vinicius Jr. And struggling to get the shot off. Emerson, wonderful goalkeeping. De Bruyne. 
Well, with tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. Foden. What can he do with it now? Could be! And did just enough defensively. Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. In with a chance. Keeper getting the touch. And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. Well, a more than decent showing from Bernardo Silva based on the first 45 minutes. Give us your assessment. Yes, he's played well, hasn't he? Obviously took his goal well, but his overall performance has been impressive too. Hopefully he and the rest of the team can maintain that level into the second half. So back in business here, City with the lead, but they won't be taking anything for granted. High quality defending. Oh, really close with that effort. Running with the ball confidently. Trying to find the right angle of attack. Can they stop it going in? Cleared away comprehensively. And Real Madrid have it back now. Trying to open up the defence. Looking for the angle and running through to the keeper. And Manchester City moving the ball with purpose. Eder Militao is with Courtois. Valverde. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Federico Valverde. Good piece of defending. Well, there you can see City haven't been able to control possession, but their speed of attack when they win the ball back has been breathtaking. It's been a really good performance from them so far. Oh, a smart stop. So, a half an hour remaining. Holland firing it towards goal. What a powerful effort, but just wide. Bellingham just dropping into that deeper position. Rodrigo. And Bellingham. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Holland. Oh, 
Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Well, he could have put it away again, but credit to the goalkeeper. Well, the way he's playing, he's surely going to get his second goal soon here. And De Bruyne firing it over. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Now, perhaps they can counter from here. Well, a disappointing end to that break. And Bernardo Silva has it. Well, can Real force the equaliser here? Their fans certainly think so. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Vinicius Junior. And will it be the leveller? Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Well, just listen to the crowd. They know this is a big chance to equalise. Luka Modric with the corner. And I'll tell you what, that looked like a certain goal. Had to be a goal. Well, that was a golden opportunity. He has to score there. And easily intercepted. And Bellingham. And back with Vinicius. Well, it's open up. And the referee has pointed to the spot. He's given the penalty. And now, let's see if they can level it up. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. And the keeper denies them from the spot. And Manchester City will go to their bench. And taken short. Brahim. Real Madrid have given us away. And Real Madrid have the ball again. It needs an accurate cross. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. Taken short. Disappointing for the players of the centre that it didn't reach them. And this might not be the ideal situation for them. Well, the fans are certainly having their say. Just listen to them. They thought that was a penalty. Real Madrid attacking, and they have to give it a go with time not on their side. And this to level it. Well, it's the late show, and they are level again. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So back underway, the game having been squared at 2 2. Silva. And it's positive from Manchester City. Is it in the cards for them to score a late winner? Alaba not given a moment's peace. Now, well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Grealish. Getting forward. But the danger averted for now. Really good build-up, but no end product. Mali prevented it from going over the line. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And we are going to have two additional minutes. Grealish. And now Rodri must take the lead here. And able to close down the shot. And so the final whistle is sounded at the end of the game. The team's not to be divided. From the point of view of the hosts, how did they fare? Derek, you can't always be at your best. And on those days, you have to grind out a result. And that's exactly what...
we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. It truly is a special place, a stadium every football fan should visit should he or she get the chance. The Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And there's a lot on the line in the relegation equation. That is a massive part of our story. It's Real Madrid against Paris Saint-Germain. Yeah, they haven't had the best of campaigns, but they have a great chance today to secure their safety. They just need a good performance and the three points. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. David Alaba plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Vinicius Jr. starts. Still alive. Just wanted to get it out of there. class goalkeeping from Courtois really inventive stuff from Real here might be dangerous crucial intervention just then amid impending danger Taken short. Oh, he's given it. Penalty. And an opportunity now for them to jump in front. Well, no card, just a warning and a fair few protestations. Well, not every foul is a yellow card. I think the referee is right here. This to make it 1 0. And the spot kick is converted as coolly as you like. One nil then. Koro Muani. Dembele. Not a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Bellingham. A very good tackle. Mbappe. Oh, skipping away. The referee has given the advantage to Real Madrid. And the intention was to let the play flow, but no real advantage forthcoming, and now a free kick. Rodrigo. Oh, they have the ball once more. Mbappe. Dembele's in the centre. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Vinicius Junior. David Alaba. Out of play in a Real Madrid throw-in coming up. Vinicius Junior just lost his focus throw in here and intercepted it that's a good pass oh a goal to give them breathing room perhaps the one that will keep them up yeah defend well now and they're safe they surely can't let this slip Away once more, 2-0 the lead here. Just the challenge that was required.
Now PSG moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Well read to put an end to that attack. Breaking at pace. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. And nicely over the top. And there it breaks down. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. of accuracy but the keeper able to turn it away a stunning stop can they keep it out and eventually goalkeeper's ball well you can sense the relief amongst his teammates but what a first save that was Eder Militao Vinicius Junior And the flag is up, offside. Well, that's just a lack of awareness. He was clearly in an offside position. Valverde, top class defending. Federico Valverde. Look at Modric. Textbook defending inside the box. An important interception. Bellingham and unable to keep possession might be a chance here and foiled by the post and they could face difficulties here and it goes down as a missed opportunity from there Hakimi Really good challenge. Carvajal. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Modric. Is with Vinicius Junior. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Can he take the chance? Oh, off the post, still alive. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, we don't often say this, do we? But Kylian Mbappe hasn't had too much to say for himself, Stuart. Well, Derek, he's usually so clever around the edge of the box. But today, he just hasn't shown that. As the touch map shows us, he hasn't had enough touches in those key areas. And off and running again after a dizzying first-half performance by Real. Will we see more of the same in the second 45? Possession changing hands. Dembele. Now with Hakimi. Surely! And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. 
Fired over by Usman Dembele. Still alive. And tucking it behind for a corner here. Well, he had the measure of it, the goalkeeper. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. Not all that convincing defensively. Very quick thinking there. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. That's a good-looking ball. Well, they promised much on the break, but ultimately delivered little. No foul. PSG advantage. Plenty of support here. And Bellingham. Terrific block. And teammates to play it to. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Oh, in with a chance! Oh, it looked as though he might be through. Not so. Modric. And the through ball from Modric. Will he shoot? The fans hope so. Looking for the angle. Looking for the final pass that will open things up. Luka Modric. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Oh, moving it nicely. Must be! Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. Well, no card, just a warning and a fair few protestations. Well, not every foul is a yellow card. I think the referee is right here. An opportunity for 3 0. And he puts it away confidently. Well, as you can see, the keeper just stands still and the ball's hit down the side of him. It's a strange one in the end. Well, on they go again. And Real very much in control. Marco Asensio. Toro Muani. Getting in there to intercept. Vinicius Junior. Given away by PSG yet again. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Keen to take it short here. Alaba failed to hold it. Well, the foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Good use of advantage in favour of PSG. Dembele and Real doing well to win it back. Jude Bellingham. Can they hit on the break? Vinicius. Can he convert? Oh, keeper dealt with it. Good refereeing, waiting for a natural pause before booking him. They favoured a short one here. Just the challenge that was required. Aurelien Chouameni. And return to Alaba. As eyes for goal. Oh, a powerful effort. Close. Oh, 
Really clever pressing. And Real with the ball again. Just ten minutes remaining here. Will they be breathing a huge sigh of relief at full time? If things stay as they are now, they will be guaranteed to stay in this division next season. Yeah, it's been one of their better performances this season, that's for sure. They just need to keep their composure now. No silly mistakes at the back, and they should be home and dry. Might be a chance to break. Well, unfortunately, it fizzled out in the end. Mbappe. Kylian Mbappe. And you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. Must finish. Well, the danger was on, but just a fraction offside. And danger averted. Well read. Given away by PSG yet again. And if you're wondering about out of time, two minutes it'll be. Well, he just couldn't make it happen. Out of play, Real Madrid throw here. This is it, a can't-miss game, and a backdrop to match the special occasion. The fans had this one circled on their calendars long ago, and now it's a matter of who will dominate on the pitch. Big characters on the big stage. What a prospect. All the action coming up next, here on EA TV. Hello from one of the great venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary, and alongside me is Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's Real Madrid versus France. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting... The Can he put it away? Not the best of efforts, was it? Well, it was a great chance, but a poor finish. He really should score there. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. David Alaba plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Vinicius Jr. starts with Rodrigo out wide. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Really good build-up, but no end product. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Ousmane Dembele plays with Kingsley Coman in the wide positions. And in attack today, Kylian Mbappe starts alongside Antoine Griezmann. But I'll tell you what, I really admire the fact that Jude Bellingham can do just about everything. He can score, he can set up chances, he can defend. What do you expect to see from him in this game? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. And fine goalkeeping.
real chance. In it goes, an early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. And France get the ball moving again. Can they come up with an answer here? Oh, this is looking promising. Griezmann! Tremendous reflexes. Thibaut Courtois. Griezmann tasked with taking the corner. Well, in fairness, it wasn't the best of headers. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Turning inside, where's he going to go? Still a chance. Managed to get it out of there. Well, he could really get at the opposition, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Aurelien Chouameni. Nicely timed tackle. Griezmann. What an important piece of defending. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Close. Vinicius Jr. It was on its way in. Valverde and now Rodrigo still looking for space he'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge Carvajal well a foul but the advantage with Real Madrid but no discernible advantage, and quite rightly, free kick awarded. Rudiger. He has teammates around him. Oh, magnificent save! Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. What reaction from the goalkeeper that was. Elects to go short. Lost into the penalty area. Well, when it left the boot, I thought it might have a chance of fooling the keeper, but it didn't. Teo Hernandez. Well, inching towards half-time, Real Madrid hold the advantage. Stuart, what strikes you about their performance so far? Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Dembele. Can he open the door to a potential goal? Well, no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper. Vinicius able to skip past his man it's got to be and it's in Real Madrid firmly enjoys 
charge here. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is... City alive with the spirit of excitement and a stadium brimming with anticipation. The build-up has been intense and now we just can't wait for it all to begin. It's anyone's guess though, which team will come out on top? The full match is coming up next on EA TV. And the floodlights are shining down on the players here on the Spanish. capital of Madrid we're at the Bernabeu I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson and on this final day there's much to play for they know full well they could secure promotion it's Real Madrid facing Manchester City well what a nervy 90 minutes this will be they just need one more good performance and three points what a game we've got in store for us So, a Real Madrid corner. Keen to take it short here. And another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. And over it comes. Poor execution with regard to the corner. Kevin De Bruyne. And good work from Real Madrid to win the ball back. Vinicius Jr. And struggling to get the shot off. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Luka Modric with the corner. Well, not the best clearance. Oh, good save. Tried to build ahead of steam. Another corner it'll be. Who can he pick out? Modric. And players waiting at the far post. And no-nonsense defensive clearance. Vinicius Jr. On to Valverde. And now Rodrigo. 
Just the challenge that was required. Rodrigo. Sloppy there, Bernardo Silva. Jude Bellingham. Bellingham. Determined defending. Grealish. Eder Militao. Rodrigo. Oh, he'll take it on. Well, the keeper made the save pretty easily in the end. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Delivered into the area here. Will it happen this time? Really good build up, but no end product. And smuggled behind for the corner. Put in by De Bruyne. On the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. the ball back with City here now look at this they might be able to cash in here Rudiger David Alaba read that pass all the way cutting it out Valverde. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. Chouameni. And Valverde. Showing a lot of guile there. He's blocked it. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. Carvajal. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Rodrigo. Bellingham. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Really inventive stuff from Real here. Can they forge ahead? And a goal! The one that could win the promotion! Well, that could be the defining moment. It's theirs to lose now. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. There to win it back. Federico Valverde. Now Eder Militao. David Alaba. Vinicius Jr. Giving it a try. Oh, they've done it! And surely now, promotion in their future! Well, 
Well, that should clinch it. What a big goal that is. Well, just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Holland. Walker. And played in. Oh, a tremendous block. So the corner played into the box. Is this the moment? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital. Back in business, and no sugarcoating it. There was a big gulf between them in the first half. Will we see a response from City in the second? Aurelien Chouameni. The ball with Luka Modric. Perfect tackle. De Bruyne. A City free kick forthcoming. And hit with ferocity! Well, the free kick taken, but saved easily by the keeper. David Alaba. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Well read to put an end to that attack. Eder Militao. Here's Carvajal. David Alaba. Real find themselves in a position of menace. He'll take this on. Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. A change in the offing for City. A corner from Modric. And City get the throw in. Rodri. Now, who can he play it to? Look at Modric. Stopped a surefire goal. Splendid tackle, and a throw-in coming up. And Real Madrid have the ball again. A delicious piece of skill. Promising move, defended it well. Well, the short corner routine. And Real couldn't hang on to the ball.
Vinicius Junior. What can Real do from this position? Andrej. And danger still. No nonsense clearance. Andrej. He has time to play it over. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Being egged on by the crowd. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty, yes. Yellow card, no. Can they make it 3-0? And he finds the net. No difficulties encountered. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. So on they go again, and every indication that Real are going to stroll to victory here. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. This looks more than decent. Ball is loose. And the referee says penalty. Well, no card handed out. He gets away with a rebuke. Well, a lot of referees would have booked him there. But I'm with him on this one. No yellow card for me. To make it 4-0. And throws it home. Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't show it. A goal from the spot. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Jeremy Doku. And now Rodrigo. Could be dangerous. Well, going for power and so close to finding the net. And Manchester City will go to their bench. That's very effective. Good high pressing. Alvarez. Into the advanced position. That's going to be a City ball. Can he create an angle? But quick thinking defensively. Look at Modric with the pass. Showing a lot of guile there. Well, what a stop that was. Rodrigo. Shaping to shoot. Well, in some style, Edison prevents a goal. So making the substitution now. Well, opting for the short corner. 
Modric. And going for goal. Pressure applied. Can they make something of it? And take it away. Brahim. Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. Well, here it is again. And I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. A City free kick forthcoming. Well, the referee won't be quite as lenient next time. Got to tread more carefully. De Bruyne. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Running with the ball confidently. Magnificent challenge to win it back. And there goes the final whistle. The celebrations can begin in earnest now. Promotion assured. Well, what a great achievement this is. You can just sense the relief out there. Well, I dare say it's going to be a big step up for everyone at the club, but I don't think they'll be complaining about that challenge. Yeah, it's going to be a tough season next year, you're absolutely right, but they don't have to worry about that. They can just enjoy the moment here. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer. But was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display. A fitting backdrop for a game of massive significance. The stage is set, a packed house at the ready, awaiting two teams who like nothing better than to test themselves on a stage like this. The tricky part is predicting which side will outfox the other. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. The floodlights are shining down on the players here in the Spanish capital of Madrid. We're at the Bernabeu. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And with the new campaign just moments away from getting started, the excitement here is palpable. It's Real Madrid, and top-notch as well as brave goalkeeping. Well, he comes off his line at just the right time. He read that brilliantly. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. David Alaba plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Rodrigo plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Clearly took a touch on the way out of play, so a throw in to come. Trent Alexander Arnold. Might work out. Can they get in behind them? A smart stop here. Well, you know, I think we should always have respect for true midfield maestros, and Luka Modric falls in that category. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him today? Well, Derek, if he's not closed down quickly today, he could score one of those special goals he's known for because he's got great technique. 
He hits through the back of the ball. It starts to dip and swerve on the goalkeeper. And it's difficult for the goalkeeper to keep hold of them. He could be the key to breaking down this defence. Carvajal. Now Eder Meritao. Valverde. Modric unable to hang on to the ball. Vinicius Jr. Gives it a go. That's a routine take. Real find themselves in a position of menace. Will he shoot? The fans hope so. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Federico Valverde. Modric. And a tidy tackle. Progress has been made by Luka Modric. The referee has let the advantage accrue to Liverpool. Top class defending. And Bellingham. Can he put them in front? But it was a wonderful chance that the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. Oh, could be. Outrageously good piece of defending on the line. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Away, away. Options in the centre. And lining it up, timely intervention. And he takes it on, and foiled by Van Dijk. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. effort just a bit wide yeah he's a good technician no doubt about that but he just got it the wrong side of the post he has to hit the target Andrew Robertson has lost the ball now the defenders know they need to get tighter given away by Liverpool again Well, Real have had so much of the ball in the last 15 minutes and they're playing really well and creating chances. It's surely only a matter of time before they take the lead here. Yes, yeah, really going so well for them and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Could be a chance to break here. And he's broken free. Well, well, well. How many players would have the confidence to try that? Simply magnificent. Well, he makes this look easy, doesn't he? But I can assure you, this takes a lot of skill to perfect. What a very good finish this is. 1-0 then. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Promising position, this. Big chance to get them on terms. And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. 
Darwin Nunez. It is advantage Liverpool here. And Salah! Can he finish here? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Well, they're going for the short one. Electing not to go along the touchline, Thiago. Shot block, but still alive. Well, couldn't bend his run, and the flag went up. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. So back in business, the second half underway. It's Liverpool in front, but far from being done and dusted. Be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Alexander Arnold. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Well, no wonder the focus is on Mohamed Salah because that was a terrific first-half display. Stuart, I know you enjoyed it very much. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Chouameni. Good bit of closing down. Wasteful from Real Madrid. Well, a decent position for Liverpool to be in. Oh, that is a superb save. He takes aim. And the keeper more than equal to it. <laughs> Playing it short. Oh, good defending to stop it. Opportunity. Well, that was the chance to extend the lead. Well, that's a waste, really. He's got to hit the target there. David Alaba. Eder Militao. Good work from Liverpool to win it back. Well, we're into the final half hour. Alaba. Really good build-up, but no end product. Well, he keeps going. And deliver towards the back post. But at one point on its flight, I wondered if the keeper would have difficulties, but no problems at the end. And Real doing well to win it back. Andrić. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. The referee has let the advantage accrue to Liverpool. Now counter-attacking possibilities. Thiago. Really committed defending. Twenty minutes to go.
Virgil van Dijk. Konate. Now with Alexander Arnold. It needs an accurate cross. Can he put it away? Save, but still a chance. Danger averted for now. Carvajal. Just the challenge that was required. Andrew Robertson. Luis Diaz. And good work from Real Madrid to win the ball back. And Modric carries it forward. Well, let's see what he does next. Can he open the door to a potential goal? Oh, he's given it away inexplicably. Excellent block. Oh, that's a fine-looking pass. And up for grabs off the keeper. And a confident clearance. Counter-attacking chance. And that puts them in position. And forcing the mistake. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Well, Rails certainly haven't been at their best, but they might just get one more big chance to draw level here. Their fans certainly think so. Just listen to them. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Substitution for Real Madrid. Well, from a long way out, not really making good use of that free kick situation. Absolutely not. That's a really poor free kick, a real waste. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. Well, the referee letting him know any more like that and he will go into the book, Stuart. Yeah, he knows he can't commit another foul now. And we are going to have two additional minutes. Luis Diaz, determined defending. And that will be all for this game anyway. Disappointment, really, when you consider this final result. A defeat, not... occasion and all week long the football chatter has centered around this game and these talented teams which one will outwit the other in a packed and passionate stadium so many questions to be answered on a day of destiny we'll have all the action for you live here on ea tv The floodlights are shining down on the players here in the Spanish capital of Madrid. We're at the Bernabeu. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. 
And everyone here on tenterhooks, you'd have to say, with good reason. It's Real Madrid facing Manchester City. Well, it's so important to make a good start to the season. If they lose again here, it immediately puts the players and coach under the spotlight. They must get something from this game. So, deflection, and it will be a throw-in. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Carvajal starts with David Alaba as fullbacks. Rodrigo plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. A gift for any goalkeeper. And so they start at 11 for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Rodri plays with Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of midfield. And providing the main goal-scoring threat today is Erling Haaland. Now in a more than decent position. Oh, that's a fine save. A corner from Modric. Well, the keeper made that look relatively easy. In truth, it wasn't. Well, Jude Bellingham has become one of the finest all-around midfield players in world football. That's no exaggeration. What do you expect to see from him today? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out of situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. Luka Modric with the corner. Well, not quite the header he had in mind. And the goalkeeper gobbling that one up. Grealish. And that's great work to make sure it didn't go over the line. Went in strongly to win the ball. Intense pressure. Courtois. David Alaba. Vinicius. Could cross it in here. Just not testing the keeper at all with that cross. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Distributing it well. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. Not the most confident clearance. Carvajal. Rudiger has it. David Alaba. Likes to run with the ball at his feet, but they dealt with the threat posed. Holland had to come up with the ball and did. And disappointing that it's gone out of play. Vardiol the ball with Rodri Silva still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead sloppy Carvajal Modric And he read it well, intercepting it. Look at Modric. Will he shoot? The fans hope so. Modric! Well, knocked on the target. The keeper seemed to have it covered. Well, he did seem to have it covered, but it's not a bad effort, though. He really did strike it well. Stones. And it's Ruben Dias. 
Well, they have the ball once more. Rodrigo just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did. Alaba failed to hold it. Just lost his focus. Throw in here. Again, City have lost the ball. Well, no stopping him. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Holland. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Cutting infield here. Modric. Who can he pick out? The defender doing his job. Grealish and support available De Bruyne well there's defensive solidity for you well in terms of added time a minimum of one minute De Bruyne playing with purpose Holland oh great block a chance then for the respective managers to address their charges it is half time here. Into the second half, then, here at the Bernabeu. on his own but couldn't take advantage of it well I'm not surprised he missed that he never really looked in complete control did he Rudiger Rodrigo and there's the clearance and that'll be a corner well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? And in by Luka Modric. Half-hearted clearance. Valverde. Well that's, well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. hard Walker now Foden a real opening now oh he stopped it well I thought that would be a goal but what a save great reactions so plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here With the game level, let's see what they can do with this corner. And taken short. Rodrigo. And a fine stop to turn the ball away. Nicely cut out. Well, Real have done everything to take the lead here. They've created some great opportunities, but they just can't make that breakthrough. 
Yes, you definitely get that feeling as they go to work once more. Rodrigo. It's still alive. Walker failed to hold it. Vinicius Jr. Firing it towards goal. Great defending. And tidy defensive play. The danger here as he runs at them. And space to cross it. And it took a touch on the way through. So a corner here. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. But he's gone short with it. Very quick thinking there. De Bruyne. Could be! And just narrowly wide in the end. And that was a very fine read. Foden. De Bruyne. And a chance for them to nudge in front. He can't hold on to it. Gvardiol. Well, City thought that was the moment they were going to take the lead. But what an excellent save from the keeper. He's just kept his team in it here. Shielding the ball superbly. Good work from City to win back the ball. Aurelien Chouameni. Vinicius Junior. That's a good pass. Diaz. He might yet finish. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Over it comes, and stopping the danger. High quality defending. Ten minutes to go. And Bernardo Silva has it. Foden, can they forge ahead? No! And all because of the goalkeeper, margins, margins. Well, he has done well there, but he should have won the game. They probably won't get another chance now. Favouring the short one. City couldn't keep it. Five minutes of the 90 still to go, and the teams cannot be separated. Can he put them in front? Well, the attack peters out, and that means it's goalkeeper's ball. And a fine tackle. Still trying to make something happen. And Sese on the front foot near the end of this contest. Still level here. And no-nonsense defensive clearance. Can they hit on the break? Well, Rail have to score soon. Time is running out. But these fans can sense the winners coming. And with that, the attack fizzles out. 
He has teammates around him. Thwarting him. Now will the cross work out for them? Attending to his defensive chores. And with that, the referee brings this match to an end. Both sides have their moments over the course of the 90 minutes, but it finishes in a stalemate. Stu Cameras trained on one man. Well, Derek, his outstanding attribute is his pace. Not just over the first few yards, but over longer distances as well. And that makes him so difficult to play against. Defenders are unsure whether to get tight or drop off. A dynamic player. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And everyone here on tenterhooks, you'd have to say with good reason. It's France facing Real Madrid. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. A glorious chance. Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. Bellingham. Well, France have certainly started this game on the front foot and they're unlucky not to be leading. That was a top-class save by the keeper. Real might threaten on the flank. Looking for the right angle. He's got to score! And up for grabs off the keeper. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Yes, man. Oh, that's a really good run. Real chance. Oh, it's an unbelievable save by Courtois. Whipped in by Griezmann. Well, not the greatest header, but astute defending. Aurelien Chouameni. Now there's a living, breathing example of positional sense. Fine run from Mbappe. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. And pressing from the front. Diaby. Pulls it back. Brilliantly blocked. Well, they're playing well now, and these fans can sense a goal coming. Griezmann just can't get it past him. I'm trying to build a head of steam. Another corner it'll be. Griezmann. Player in the way again. Fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection. So now a throw in. Griezmann. Mbappe. David Alaba. Promising pass. And he did well to cut it out. Griezmann. And Bellingham. Given away by Rabio. He has teammates around him. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Mbappe. The defender put in the challenge, and it might be a red card. 
And in the refereeing trade, they call it Dogzo, denial of a goal-scoring opportunity. Well, the referee's got that right. He saved the possibility. goal there but at a cost Dembele let's fly here it could be up for grabs and the flag is up offside well that's just a lack of awareness he was clearly in an offside position Lucas Vasquez, and now Rodrigo. Eder Militao. Given away by Real Madrid. Griezmann must take the lead here. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Well, that was a big chance for France to take the lead there. But what a brilliant save from the keeper. He's really pulled out all the stops on that occasion. Well, pushing again for a goal, looking full of purpose. Oh, he's gone for goal. He didn't miss by very much. Yeah, he adjusted his body so well there. It's a great piece of skill, and it probably deserved the goal. Real Madrid have given it away. Flag raised for offside. Bellingham. Modric. There's a cut back. Might go ahead. And a goal! They've taken the lead! Well, playing a man short, but that doesn't seem to bother them. We shouldn't be surprised. Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Well, he got the touch on the ball, and so a corner it'll be. Griezmann. Long way out, this. Well, the goalkeeper's life wasn't made quite as difficult as might have been the case. Vinicius. Could play it in. Timely intervention. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And it is a booking, and their approach is nothing short of feisty. Well, they have to keep their discipline here. They can't afford to lose another player. Prepare to take on the shot. And gobbled up by Courtois. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Not well, made it look routine, but read it well. Well, time is up as far as the first half is concerned here in Marseille. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play.
The ball moving again. Real have the lead, but they won't be taking anything for granted. Aurelien Chouameni. Kylian Mbappe. A smart stop here. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. Well, there's no way to escape the verdict that that was an awful corner. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. What can Real do from this position? Takes aim! Oh, that is a superb save! Now sending it in, and clearing it away. Lucas Vasquez. On the ball, Rudiger. And France regaining possession. This could be the equaliser. Can they slot it home? Diaby. Must be. An alert piece of defending. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Well, when you see those stats, it's amazing how they're trailing in this game because they've created so many chances. They just haven't taken them. At some point, they've got to get back into this game. They have the ball again. What can they do with it? And a chance to whip it in here. Pretty straightforward in the end. Eder Militao. Courtois. Now Eder Militao. And it's with Courtois. David Alaba. And Bellingham. France with the ball again. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Lucas Vasquez. Now with Bellingham. And playing it through. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. And nicely over the top. He's given us away. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Into the final 20 minutes. And an astute piece of defending. Aurelien Chouameni. Uh, plays with a positional sense that is second to none. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Aurelien Chouameni. Mbappe. And a timely intervention. Rodrigo. He's got to have a go here. Well, I gave him the big build-up, but the keeper has it comfortably. Dembele. And here's Saliba. Just ten minutes to go. Aurelien Chouameni. 
Well, still time for them to level it. Hernandez. Oh, good work by the keeper. Over the touchline for what will be a France throw. Who can he pick out? It is a decent looking attack here. Trying to find the right angle of attack. Rabio. And couldn't quite square the game. Close. Well, it's certainly a decent effort, but not quite good enough. They still trail here. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Well, it's not quite in the books yet, but almost for Real Madrid as they try to see it out. Stuart, what have you made of their overall performance? Well, they need to hold on here. Not long left now, but you have to say they've defended really well up to this point, and I just can't see them conceding now. This will be a really good win if it stays like this. Well, by playing keep ball like this, they're keeping the opposition at bay. Diaby. Oh, it's a superb challenge. Very timely. Giving it their all in search of an equaliser. And there goes the final whistle. I'll tell you what, relief in the camp because they've stopped the early season rock with this performance. Well, it's been a torrid start for them, but today was so much better. That special and unbeatable feeling of match day is in the air and the knowledge that this has all the makings of a vibrant and compelling encounter. Anticipation levels are sky high and every expectation this game will live up to its billing. Stay with us, we have every kick of the ball next here on EA TV. Well, you can certainly feel the excitement tonight here at the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It is Manchester United, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out, who will affect the game, and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Well, an attempt to forget all about, unfortunately. Yeah, got it all wrong, trying to pass it into the corner, opened up his body, but did make the right sort of contact. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. David Alaba plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Rodrigo plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've got Rashford! What a start they've made. Rudiger. This is Alaba. Nice switch of play. There to win it back. Rashford. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Happy to take on the shot. 
Well, you have to put that one down as a chance to draw level. Well, it certainly wasn't an easy chance, but one they needed to take. Casemiro. Real might threaten on the flank. Will he play it in? Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Casemiro. Extremely sloppy in possession. From one side of the pitch to the other. Eder Militao. David Alaba. Here's Carvajal. David Alaba. United come away with it. Out of play in a Real Madrid throw-in coming up. Great vision to switch the play. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Carvajal. David Alaba. Now Eder Militao. Attacking possibilities for Real. Luka Modric. Very quick thinking there. And it's United's turn now. Pivotal moment defensively. Diogo Dallo. It's going to be United's free kick. Here's Luke Shaw. Good tackle, take it away. So nearing the half-time break and Real Madrid with a bit of work to do. Stuart, your thoughts on their performance? Well, they've not had quite enough purpose to their attacking play so far. It's all been a bit too predictable. But in the second half, if they can get more support to their strikers and play with greater intensity, they can certainly turn this around. Potentially freedom for United on the flank. And that is how to block. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Pressing like that will help the cause. Well, that could prove to be a big moment in the game. They still have a chance here, and that's thanks to that save by Courtois. Excellent vision. And that'll be the goalkeeper's ball. Smuggled away. Realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. So no more time left. That concludes the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. The second half underway, United with the advantage, but no room for complacency. Oh. 
Opportunity here. Really high class goalkeeping from Courtois. And Bellingham. And that is defending of the highest order. Casemiro. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. And the defenders know they need to get tighter. Must be really committed defending. Let's get the latest on the injury situation from our pitch side man, Jeff Shreves. He keeps looking down and feeling his foot, so that's obviously the problem. And I think it came from that last challenge. Cheers, Jeff. Oh, great header. Smart stop, though. United pushing to add to the lead. It'll be a corner. And United will switch things around for wonderful header. Excellent goalkeeping. Well, one thing we'd have to say about Marcus Rashford in that first half, very difficult to subdue. What did you make of what you saw from him? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Surely the equaliser. And it's in beyond the goalkeeper, Real Madrid on level. Well, I'm sure the replay will confirm he got a touch on this, which he does. So he'd be really upset that he didn't keep it out. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. 30 minutes left for play. Carvajal. David Alaba. Vinicius Jr. Teammates in the middle. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Danger averted for now. Running room galore for United. Real chance. Great defending. David Alaba. Here's Valverde. Vinicius Jr. Rudiger has it. Sloppy Carvajal. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Really inventive stuff from Real here. And the reflection. Jun means a corner. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. And deciding to go short with this one. Diaz. Carvajal. Vinicius Jr. And a useful cross. Well, it smacks into the gloves of the goalkeeper. Well, that was another example of their poor finishing today because some of the build-up play by Real Madrid has been really good. They should be in complete control of this game. Rodrigo, an effective challenge. Oh, read it magnificently. Tremendous defending.
High pressure on David Alaba. Carvajal. And level it is in the closing moments. Can Real Madrid change that? And teammates to play it to. Oh, an incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. Well, what a final few minutes we have here. And the fans are certainly playing their part. But can they take one of these chances that come their way and win this game? The supporters want to see him have a go. Must take the lead here. And they do. And with so little time left, that will surely be decisive. Astonishing drama. Rudiger. Rodrigo Real Madrid attacking and they have to give it a go with time not on their side but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending Diogo Dallo oh great vision just had to look a bit lively given the pressure Brahim Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. In a decent position now. The final whistle, and not to be for Real Madrid. They have to accept defeat. What did you think of their performance as a whole? Quality, lots of good individual displays in... Historically has been Barcelona at home against Real Madrid on this occasion. I'm Derek Ray, sitting alongside me here on the gantry is Stuart Robson. And Stuart, this ought to be special. Well, Derek, this is a magnificent setting for a great rivalry. Let's just hope we see both teams play at their very best today. What an occasion this should be. So, a Real Madrid corner. Going short. Really effective shielding under pressure. Look at Modric. Here's Vinicius Junior. Well, making considerable progress with the ball. This looks more than decent. And whipped into the box. Well, just couldn't quite control the header. And a disappointing effort in the end. De Jong. That's a very fine piece of tackling. And Bellingham. Joao Felix. And credit due, a good intervention. Nice switch of play. Carvajal. David Alaba. Another eyeing that final pass you just feel. Vinicius Jr. Absolutely nothing wrong with the idea, but no end product. Lewandowski. On the ball, Joao Felix. And he stopped them in their tracks. Valverde. Using space on the opposite flank now. Carvajal. Well, 
nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Corner given to Real Madrid. Taken short. Rodrigo. He's blocked it. Pedri. It's with Joao Cancelo. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. And support available. Pedri. De Jong. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. What can Real do from this position? Giving it a try. To Stegen, it's an unbelievable save! And in by Luka Modric. Well, the danger is still there. Vinicius Jr. Rudiger. Carvajal. Looks as though there might be a threat, but not so in the end. Good defending. Pedri. Rodrigo a chance to whip it in well, he failed to get it away properly well that's a sad end to the attack well they have it again Lewandowski and Real come away with it and Bellingham oh that's a super piece of defending Pedri plenty of support here Gundogan can he put them in front oh my word there's excellent timing for you what a challenge The switch of play now. Federico Valverde. David Alaba. Real Madrid have given it away. Pedri. Lewandowski. They've ceded possession, Barca. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. So back underway here into the second half.
Effective challenge. Pedri. Lewandowski. A very timely interception. Now options are plenty. That's a good-looking ball. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. That's not a bad ball. Well, just couldn't quite control the header and a disappointing effort in the end. Frankie de Jong. It's with Gundogan. Lewandowski. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. The Merengues have lost the ball. Gunduan. Can they forge ahead? Huge block. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. Well, an example of a counter attack that went nowhere. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position. Rafinha. And is this the moment for Lewandowski? And you just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Is he able to dispatch it? But into the keeper's gloves. Well, those stats tell you everything. Barca's finishing has been poor today, which is a shame because their attacking play has been really good. But I do feel they will come away with a victory here. Eder Militao. Given away by Real Madrid. Promising move from Barcelona. Joao Cancelo. Tenacious tackling. Excellent defending there. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. And Bellingham. Well, they have to pay attention. Opportunity. And a goal! Now they've broken through. 1-0 here. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, but there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. Rafinha. This could be troublesome. Some of the fans are screaming, have a go. And a chance to level it. And it has gone a begging. Good heavens. Well, that should have been the equaliser. A golden opportunity wasted there. And Real with the ball again. And into the last 20 minutes. Teammates available. Can they put it away? Opportunity, maybe. And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. And Real pushing to add to the lead. It's a corner. Taken short. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Well, not long left now, but these Barca fans still believe they can get back into this one. Gundogan. And Barca moving the ball with purpose. Joao Cancelo. Felix. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Oh, how about that for a tackle? Well, the fans are certainly having their say. Just listen to them. They thought that was a penalty. A 
it is a decent looking attack here and they've played their way into trouble Ten minutes to go then. Shot attempted. How about this for drama? All even once more. Astonishing. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Back underway. Level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Jude Bellingham. Modric's repulsions around him. Still level. Real Madrid continue to look for what could be a winner. Well, quite simply, the cross was too close to the keeper. De Jong. Well, Barcelona have to score soon. Time is running out. But these fans can certainly sense a winner coming here. Can they forge ahead? Yes is the answer. And that could be oh so important. just how good this goal is it has everything skill pace and power there was no stopping him there what a big moment in the dying embers will it prove decisive here Carvajal and now Rodrigo really showing off his wide range of passing skills Carvajal. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Well, still time for them to level it. And Bellingham. And in with a real chance. And it's in beyond the goalkeeper. Real Madrid on level. Underway again at 2 all, and that is going to be all for this game. Well, we were treated to goals, but no winner. Stay is in the air, and the knowledge that this has all the makings of a vibrant and compelling encounter. Anticipation levels are sky high, and every expectation this game will live up to its billing. The game is live in its entirety, next on EA TV. It's very much a temple of football, the Santiago Bernabeu, right here on the Spanish capital, Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary, and my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's Real Madrid facing Real Madrid. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Well, possibilities in the centre. And Bellingham. Routine stop for Courtois. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Carvajal starts with David Alaba as fullbacks. Vinicius Jr. starts with Rodrigo out wide. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Fernand Mendy starts with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Federico Valverde plays. Oh, Derek, there's a chance here. Magnificent defending. The corner from Modric. And the danger cleared. A 
Oh, tremendous vision. Real Madrid doing well to regain possession here. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Modric waiting. And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. And taken short. Rodrigo. David Alaba. On the ball, Rudiger. Really good attacking play. Well, just centimetres away. Narrowly wide. Yeah, but the goalkeeper had it covered, no doubt about that. I think he would have saved it. Mendy. Chouameni. Well, it's all about passing as they try to hit the front. A good and fair challenge. And they do like to press whenever they can. Rudiger. And Bellingham. Vinicius Junior. It ought to be the goalkeeper's ball. Is with Vinicius Junior. Passing like that, part of Luka Modric's game. Corner for Real Madrid. Who's going to get on the end of it? And just wide of the post with a header. A oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. Well, Real Madrid have certainly had all the possession over the last 15 minutes. They're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat. You feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination. Yes, it's going to plan, and they might be able to carve out another chance. Could be threatening. Rodrigo. Well, it's open up. Luka Modric at the ready. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Vinicius Junior. Vinicius Junior. Valverde. Here's Modric. And a very good challenge. And the through ball from Modric. The supporters want to see him have a go. Well, there is the opening goal. The pressure finally telling. And they get the due reward. Well, back underway. And 1-0 it is. Let's we'll see what happens next. Rich. Now with Vinicius Junior. Could be. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Carvajal. Given away by Real Madrid. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Defenders need to cover. Big chance! And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Not giving him a moment's peace. From one side of the pitch to the other. Rodrigo. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Untidy in possession. Well, a really good run. 
Valverde now with Mendy wasted possession again and the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point Stuart well Derek he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout so the ball rolling again second half underway will Real be able to up the game Rudiger here's Carvajal good through ball Rodrigo that's a useful cross and just wide there really wasn't much in that at all Carvajal and very deftly cut out Rodrigo chance here just couldn't get it through opportunity now well, defenders having to cover up clearly took a touch on the way out of play so a throw in to come effective challenge well breaking at pace is always a possibility but the danger averted for now Carvajal Courtois Chouameni and the ruling is offside here and a good looking pass Vinicius Junior magnificent defending Carvajal well a bit wasteful from the Merengues Vinicius it's there for him magnificent defending So a half an hour remaining. Really getting stuck in. It's a weighted pass. Well, the keeper knew it was crucial he didn't make a mistake. Rodrigo. Look at Modric. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Surely! And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. Substitution for Real Madrid. And short it is. Madrid regaining possession David Alaba Federico Valverde good ball to switch the play Vinicius Junior nothing for the players in the middle to work with and the referee says corner kick Well, they fancy a short one. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Carvajal. Tony Kroos. And a timely intervention. Great opportunity. Oh, fine stop. Played over. 
And you're not going to bamboozle the goalkeeper with a corner like that. Now, will the keeper have to pay the price for that mistake? Vinicius Jr. Chance to cross. Half-hearted clearance. Well, nothing untoward happened. Now, options are plenty. Rodrigo. Oh, surely. Tremendous reflexes. Thibaut Courtois. time as is here Luka Modric with the corner just the clearance that was needed oh an incredible save to preserve their lead well that's a great stop and probably a match winning one real drama late on here and time for the change now. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. And Bellingham. This could be it! A really excellent piece of goalkeeping, and that's what they needed. Well, it's a good save at just the right time, but they have to get the ball forward quickly here. And that's great work to keep it in play. An important interception. Well, still playing here. Real Madrid want to make this a victory. Stuart, interested in your thoughts on their overall performance? Well, it's going to be a nervy end to this game. But if they do hold on, I think they've deserved their win. They've played really well and they've played some good attacking football. And in general, they've controlled the game. Target by Miles with that one, and a goal kick will ensue. And they will make the change now. Tony Kors is with Vinicius Jr. Oh, great vision. They're showing a willingness to attack as they must, given the circumstances. Time running out. And Bellingham pulls it back. Well, his accuracy deserted him at a crucial moment. Well, he had to score there. That's probably the game over now. So there goes the final whistle. Real Madrid victorious, and their fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, it was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and chance. round player but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat and when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper he usually scores stay tuned we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV It truly is a special place, a stadium every football fan should visit should he or she get the chance. The Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's Real Madrid taking on Real Madrid. Well, fair play, he took on the shot, but he's not going to be happy with how it ended. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. 
Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Carvajal starts with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. Tony Kroos plays alongside Federico Valverde in central midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. David Alaba plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Vinicius Jr. starts with Rodrigo out wide. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And the decision is one of offside here. Well, Jude Bellingham rightly receives plenty of plaudits because he's a leader out there on the pitch. What might we see from him in this game? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him, his movement is excellent, and in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. And in with a real chance. Well, that is high-level goalkeeping. Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. That's goalkeeping of the highest quality, I would say. Course. Now with Valverde. Really good challenge. Can he find the right pass? A smart stop here. Course with the corner. And did his job defensively. And he did well to cut it out. Real find themselves in a position of menace. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. David Alaba. Might really be able to trouble them here. He's blocked it! And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. And a good tackle. David Alaba. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. Oh, a brilliantly timed tackle when it really mattered. That was a move of great promise. They could easily have been in. Rodrigo. And he has options available. Bellingham! Not out of the woods yet. Oh, chance taken! There is opportunism for you. But a disappointed goalkeeper. Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one. But they can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. And the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? From one side of the pitch to the other. Vinicius Junior. This is Kroos. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Rodrigo. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Trying to pick out a teammate. And a fantastic diving save. Not a chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. Not all that convincing defensively. Vinicius. Now, who can he play it to? That's not a bad ball. Pretty simple for the keeper. Vinicius Junior. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Can he get them level? Opportunity here. And a goal! The keeper couldn't stop it. Real Madrid on terms.
Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. One, one. Jude Bellingham. Vinicius Jr. Stopped a certain goal. Really committed himself to the tackle and a throw in now. Valverde. Eder Militao. This is Alaba. Bellingham. Well, a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Alaba. And the cross goes in. Able to deal with the threat. This might be ideal for the counter. Look at Modric with the pass. Just needs to steady himself. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, as the replay shows us, Modric picks out the pass to beat that defensive line. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital. You certainly have got to give this man a heart. The ball moving again. Real have the lead, but they won't be taking anything for granted. Nice switch of play. In with a chance. And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Chouameni. Now with Bellingham. Cross. A very effective challenge put in. Well, they might be able to launch a counter attack. And decent acreage for Real Madrid to run into. And played in. Oh, but claimed by the goalkeeper. Eder Militao. This is Cross. And he has options available. Penalty in the opinion of the referee. And this is seriously getting away from them. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. Can they stop it going in? Ball back with Real now. Federico Valverde. So a throw in for Real Madrid. Vinicius. Perfect tackle. Oh, fancy footwork. The delivery. Opportunity, maybe. Well, credit to him for trying it. Didn't miss by much. Now well, we have 30 minutes to go. And Real Madrid have it back now. Plenty of players waiting in the middle.
Luka Modric. Alaba comes up with it. Modric. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Well, it's a good-looking position. Is there a goal in the future? But really sticking to their task defensively. Well, that one has promise. And there the move ends for now. Vinicius Junior. Rodrigo. He has time to play it over. Gets his glove on it. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Well, he's certainly not alone. Played in there by Danny Cabajal. Well, the keeper wasn't fooled by it at all, in actual fact. Really getting stuck in. Rudiger. Eder Militao. Hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them. And Bellingham. Modric. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Well, you have to say, it was a great save and a vital one. Had that got in, it was game over for Real Madrid. Can they force one more big chance here? Well, as spectacular as the save was, it can't be just about their stellar keeper. They know that. This could square the game. The crossbar got in the way. Carvajal. Now with Valverde. A glorious chance. Oh, that is a superb save. Well, that could prove to be the decisive moment in the match. Real Madrid did everything but score there. Can they force one more big chance before the end? Rudiger. A switch of play now. Jude Bellingham. Well, and it... Able to bend his run offside. Over the touchline for what will be a Real Madrid throw. Well, still time for them to level it. Brahim. Here's Carvajal. Well, a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Oh, great defending. And the referee says that will do it. It's the end of the game, and it's a victory for Real Madrid. Their fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall, they had the better of the chance.
Will they be breathing a huge sigh of relief at the end of the game? With a draw, guaranteed to stay up. It's Manchester City. They take on Real Madrid, and it's coming up next on EA TV. Hello and welcome. Absolutely ideal weather for football here in Manchester at the Etihad. I'm Derek Ray and sharing commentary with me as usual is Stuart Robson. And expect quite a few twists and turns. There is the possibility that safety could be assured come full time. It is Manchester City and they take on Real Madrid. Well, they certainly won't want to go into the final game still in danger of relegation. So in my view, they should go flat out to get a result today, which will make for a very good watch. And so they starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield and lining up through the middle in attack today. And in with a real chance. Oh, a goal to give them breathing room. Perhaps the one that will keep them up. Yeah, defend well now and they're safe. They surely can't let this slip. Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place, but give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. And the right place to cut out the pass. Modric. Well, he's been ruled offside. Foden. Foden. Oh, breezing past him. Now the cut back. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Oh, he's through here. And the keeper's in trouble. Oh, that is a moment of pure quality. A goal for football lovers to enjoy the world. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and the finish is so clever. He just gets his toe under the ball and thinks it over the keeper. That's a lovely goal. Jack Grealish. It's a promising City move. Chance to get themselves back into it. It must go in, surely. And a goal. It was served up on a silver platter for him. Vinicius Jr. The ball back with Real now. Well, the referee trying to play advantage there, but it wasn't forthcoming. Vinicius Jr. Modric. Modric! Well, marginally wide. So, so close. This is a message for Alex O'Neill. Rodri, excellent use of advantage from the referee in City's favour. Very alertly winning back possession. It is advantage Manchester City here. Holland and a goal! And now it really is all a bit too close for comfort. Well, as things stand, they're still clear of the relegation zone, but it's tight. They can't afford to concede another now. Well, just watch this again. Grealish's pass is inch perfect. And what a finish from Haaland. It gives the keeper absolutely no chance. It's such a powerful strike. Rodrigo. Aurelien Chouameni. Passing like that, part of Luka Modric's game. Oh, how about that for a tackle? Vadiol on to Holland. Perfectly positioned to take it away. 
And the advantage is with City. Walker, crossing into the middle. Oh, it's in! And that's not going to help the cause in the relegation fight. Well, they've only got themselves to blame. They've been dropping far too deep, almost inviting pressure. So Real restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they find an equaliser? And passing it through. Well, the attack just lost its momentum. And the keeper will collect. Now will the keeper have to pay the price for that mistake? A massive sigh of relief in the end. That was nearly very costly. Well, he got lucky there. That was a big mistake by the goalkeeper. Can he get the level? Oh, a tremendous reflex action there from the keeper. Well, he didn't have long to react, did he? But that's a top-class save, I have to say. And in by Luka Modric. It hasn't come to very much. Modric purposefully. Not the best clearance. Can he do it? Terrific piece of anticipation. A very effective challenge put in. The referee has given the advantage to Real Madrid. And a long way out here. Goal! What a massive goal at that. Perhaps the one that will keep them up. Well, it certainly is an important goal, but they have to keep switched on here. Well, let's take another look, because this is a special goal. He's so far out when he strikes it. He couldn't have hit that any better. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Surely! Straight forward for the keeper. Excellent use of advantage from the referee in City's favour. Well, sometimes advantage just doesn't work out. And the referee has awarded a free kick now. And that's great work to keep it in play. What to like about that pass. Chance for Bernardo Silva. Can he make it count? And he hits it well, but off the post. Goal kick it'll be. And the through ball from Modric. Had to get that spot on and did. Fantastic challenge. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Oh, lovely ball. No let up here. Many. Half time, that will do it for the first half here at the Etihad. Well, I think we really need quite a few superlatives to accurately describe Erling Haaland's first half performance. Stuart, interested to get your thoughts as always. Well, what an outstanding first half he had. He dictated the play and was a constant threat with his ability on the ball. Surely he's going to be marked a lot tighter in the second 40. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Well, possibilities inside the box. Oh, fancy footwork. And he takes it on. And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve.
Well, how about this? 4-3. Diesch. Holland. Chances on. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. Still not clear. Foden. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Modric. Committed challenge. Holland. Holland. Tremendous reflexes. Thibaut Courtois. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? It is advantage Manchester City here. Determined defending. Chance maybe to use their counter-attacking ability to good effect. Brilliant pass. Modric. Oh, surely. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Foden. Erling Haaland. Can he get them level? And that's what they needed, Manchester City. A goal to level matters here. Well, just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly, he gets beyond his marker, and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Modric. Sound piece of defending. Alaba failed to hold it. Foden. The ball with Rodri. And the challenge, crisp and clean. City moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? A fine reading of the situation. Fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection. So now a throw in. Bellingham. And Sissi with the ball again. Jude Bellingham. Rodrigo. And a significant block following that cross. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. And he couldn't quite get himself back on side, Stuart. Well, as a player, you need to be able to change your mind. But he wasn't able to, and that's a poor pass. Not showing good vision. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Not much time to make up his mind. Luka Modric. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Well, that one has promise. Well, thumped clear. Could be a chance to break here. Good vision. Can he get onto this? A smart stop here.
And fired over by Kroos. No nonsense piece of defending. Well, the counter chance looks very real. And it's positive from Manchester City. Is it in the cards for them to score a late winner? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Well, not long to go now. Can they see this out? And look at the live table tells us they're minutes away from confirming their status in this division for next season. Well, it's not been a great... Oh, they've done it! They forged ahead, and it might be the goal that gives them victory. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Vinicius Junior. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Manchester City have work to do. But is it going to happen for them? And read the danger magnificently. Well, if he gets this wrong, a penalty and a sending off. But he was spot on with his challenge. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. The delivery. Ah, oh, goalkeeper's ball. Not the best of crosses, really, was it? And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. De Bruyne. De Bruyne. He needed to get there and did, but still the possibility. This could level it. And we are going to have two additional minutes. And straight out of play off the keeper's boot. It will be a throw-in. The referee has decided to give the free-kick decision the way of City. An unforced error, you've got to say. And there goes the final whistle. Now we can say it. They'll be staying in this division next season. No relegation for them, Stuart. Yeah, what relief for the players and the manager. It's been a really difficult... Lingering on Erling Haaland. Yet another exceptional performance to add to the...